What's up guys, Vermel here from BC Heights PH and today I'm gonna show you how I build this DIY wooden keyboard wrist rest. Stay tuned and I will show you just how I build it. Started off by a piece of pine wood and mark it at 35 centimeters. It is always a smart idea to cut your woods to rough length using a jigsaw. But if your jigsaw is well calibrated, by all means, finalize a cut using your jigsaw. But as for me, rough cut moon as a jigsaw, then final cut using a table saw with sled. Regardless if you're using a real table saw or a DIY table saw just like me, to always check using a speed square that the saw blade is 90 degrees to the surface of your table. And since I don't have a jointer, I will use my table saw and find the straightest edge possible of this board to flatten one face as well as flatten one edge. This will give me a perfect 90 degrees angle on the board. I built some sled to help me with the angle of this project, made from one half scrap plywood. On top of the plywood is a piece of scrap cut at a 10 degree angle to help me taper the board. The board is clamped on its side and will sit on my table saw sled. Next, I started sanding. Drawing pencil lines on your board is a great way to know that you're ready for the next grid. Once the lines are gone, you know you're good to go. For doing my final sanding, 
I cut the board to size using my table saw with sled. I should end up at 29 centimeters to match the dimension of the keyboard. Now I will make sure to knock off the edges of the board because the last thing you would want is to get cut because of sharp edges. I used 80 grit, 120 grit, and 400 grit sandpaper. After final sanding, I applied a water-based polyurethane two coats in total to endure wear and tear. about that pine? It looks amazing. Alright, so this wooden wrist rest is based on a 60% keyboard. But if your keyboard has a different size, feel free to change its dimension. I will put up in the description below the dimensions that I used for this one. Again, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and please consider subscribing to my channel. God bless you all.